Hey everybody, good morning. Chris at U-Joint. Finishing up this Jayco. It's going to New York. I believe this is our first Class C of 2020, but we've got three or four more here, so you're gonna see us cranking a lot of Class Cs this year. Beach season is about to begin in New York. I know everyone wants their rigs and wants to get out on the beach. So this is a um, basically brand new. It's a 2020 Jayco Greyhawk. I'll give you the exact model when I walk around the passenger side. Uh, standard recipe for us on these RVs, we weigh them before we have springs built. So they're spec to the actual weight of the rig. When these things leave the factory, they're all undersprung drastically. That's why they drive so bad. Then we lift them six inches. They drive better, handle better, steer better. And of course you get the added traction of four wheel drive up front. So uh, got our FB002 front bumper with the front receiver. No lights yet, no winch yet. The customer will probably add that later, as well as a black grill. He's got a black grill he's gonna swap out when he gets home. Stage two front axle, 456 gears to match the rear. Detroit True Track, RSC upgrade. So it's got the big 14 and a half inch diameter rotors, which is a nice upgrade for these big heavy guys. Single Fox 2.0. We added a brand new Ford T case to the back of the uh, 6R140 transmission. Custom drive shaft in the front, and then shortened the rear shaft and added the slip yoke for this drive shaft. Uh, this rig does have our OBA system and an S pod. This S pod, he's ready for lights later. He's got our OBA accessory kit too. So we plumb the OBA, we do a little differently on these RVs. We, we run an airline to the front, like we would on any rig, um, especially with our bumper, but we also run them to the sides, so they have three ports. So you got one right there, and then one on the other side. In the rear, we've got some stock RV dually wheels that we uh, sandblast and powder coated black. Rear tire is a 255-85-16. Front tire, I don't think I specified, is a 295-70-17 Toyo Mud Terrain on a Pro Comp wheel. This thing actually had an upgraded sway bar in it already, so we just added our link kit to make it a little stiffer. Instead of relying on those bushings, got a nice solid mount RV uh, sway bar in the rear. It looks good. Fox 2.0 is in the back also. Out back, we did one of our custom tire carriers. We built quite a few of these. Every RV is a little different, so I think we've maybe had two over the years we've been building these tire carriers that have been the same. So um, the structure is basically the same of what we build. We just make different adapter brackets for the chassis. Like I said, it's a Jayco Greyhawk. It's a 30X. I'll go ahead and go inside since it's the number one question I get. I'm not an RV salesman, but I just gave you the model name if you want a good RV tour. Google it, and I'm sure you'll find some professionals giving you a full tour of these things. Look at that counter. That's crazy. I haven't really been in. I usually don't come in the side of the RVs. There's no point for me to be in here, but um, this thing is pretty pimp. Huge slide. And then you can see our shifter. And that's it. Super nice rig. Headed to Long Island. I am planning a trip up there for the summer. Probably going to come up with my kids this year. Looking forward to that. Hanging out with all of our uh, Long Island RV people. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram if you don't already. Subscribe to the channel. We appreciate the support. Got any comments, leave them in, or uh, any questions, leave them in the comments. Or shoot me an email, chris at ujoinoffroad.com. Thanks.